first question we received is what security related solutions are available or what would you recommend to support WAN to client, meaning a third party location and WAN to public cloud connectivity? There's a lot of options, right, for these. Uh, so to answer and, and the, the two uh, ways that the questions have broken down here are actually uh, kind of where the different solutions will lie, right? So WAN to client or even client into the WAN, you, know, you can use something simple like a, a, a an on-demand VPN from the client side. Um, that's probably most common and uh, most firewalls offer that. And there are a bunch of uh, both commercial and open source options uh, that are standalone. Um, there's also, you know, for WAN to public cloud, uh, you know, I always think that a good solution is to, um, you know, access something through a, uh, someone who's able to give you a direct connect or express connect, basically a direct, you know, a uh, physical connection to basically just completely eliminate the internet layer, uh, from your securities, you know, sort of, uh, area that you have to cover. Uh, and if you want to, on top of that, you can, of course, you know, layer on MacSec, IPsec, uh, various other encryption protocols. Uh, you know, Charles, do you have any other, other thoughts there? I think my, my biggest thing to add is uh, take a, uh, a layered approach um, and not look just at the network level uh, for encryption, but make sure you're also looking at your application layer uh, for security and not relying on those VPN tunnels and things like that. Um, for transmitting your data between applications and between applications and clients, um, because if data leaks out, uh, gets routed incorrectly, then uh, you could potentially be up a, up, a, up a creek. Is that common to see that separation in term? And I don't mean separation, obviously there are different aspects, but to see completely different groups within an organization managing the network and then the application level security and them not being in collaboration or in close communication to make sure that those are aligned? Because it seems like it would be pretty easy for that to get separated in an organization that's moving very, very rapidly. Yeah, that, that definitely can happen. And, and and you're right to highlight it as an area that you definitely want to make sure everybody's moving in lockstep and that, you know, maybe that there's at least, if not one overarching team, at least an overarching working group that uh, kind of works together to answer those questions uh, cohesively instead of, uh, you know, piecemeal. Yeah. The other thing I'll add is that in my uh, previous life as an application developer, um, I just assumed that everything that was transmitted over the network was wide open and uh, uh, accommodated from there um, at the application layer. That's a good point. Assume the worst. Yep.